Okay, tell me a little bit about yourself, uh, who you are, and, and what you've got there. My name is Susan McKnight, and I have created a bedbug monitor called the Climb of Insect Interceptor. It's a very simple device. It's plastic, polyethylene, and you place it underneath your bed legs. This will act as a trap device for bed bugs that are either coming to the bed or bed bugs leaving the bed. The human being that's sleeping in that bed is the uh, attractor, is the bait. <laughs> On the outside of the climb up is a fibrous surface that insect can climb up. They fall into the outer pitfall if they're coming from the room. Bed bugs are always dispersing from the bed, particularly the adult female after she is fed. She's trying to leave the bed and spread the colonies. She will appear in this center well. So you can tell if bed bugs are coming or going and whether or not the infestation is present. What something that makes this device quite different from every other device on the market is that this fiber surface allows the tiny first instar nymphs to get in and they're very difficult to see. Therefore, the white surface allows you to see those almost clear uh, tiny first instar bed bugs. We also make a extra large version if you have a very large bed frame that will not fit into the original size interceptor. Um, these also will allow this deeper uh, design will allow you to leave the monitor down for several weeks because they cannot climb out even if you have a large population. Inside the climb up it is coated with baby powder, it's talc. That talc makes the surface too slick for the bed bugs to climb out. It's not acting as a pesticide. In order for the climb up to continue working for weeks or years, you simply remove the bed bugs with a cotton ball that's been dipped in talc or baby powder and restore the talc and removing the dust and the bed bugs will continue to be captured for months or years. Now we do have a problem with the climb up over padded carpet that they will crack because it will be deformed by the bed leg. So if you're using it over carpeting, it's a good idea to reinforce with a jar lid or, some, or a piece of wood to keep it from changing shapes. And uh, where can people find, is this something that they'd want to order online through your website or is this? Certainly you can order if you are a, a, a large buyer. I sell wholesale to the commercial pest control industry and also property management companies. If you are just a homeowner wanting to purchase for you can purchase them through several online distributors uh, listed on my website www.insect-interceptor.com and also it's available through retail through Bed Bath & Beyond. Uh, and so, would I see in the in the in the picture here too? Uh, it's not only beds, uh, so people might use that on on a couch, on a table, anywhere. In any place that you suspect that bed bugs might be present, you can place the interceptor underneath, and then look at it periodically to see if you see a bed bug. Now, this will only work if in an occupied room or space because bed bugs are not stimulated to move around unless they smell the exhaled breath of the person, the carbon dioxide coming from the person. So you use the interceptors in a place where people are sleeping and living and uh, so even if it, even you can even place the interceptor on just on the floor and not underneath a piece of furniture if you have active bed bugs walking around. Excellent.